shorthanded opportunities, defensive zone plays, and the shame of blowing a two-goal lead. The PG Masters Ball Hockey League has it all, except for the skates and ice, of course. Ah, it's a good exercise for us. We've always been trying to get some extra teams in the league. This year we got one extra team, so we allow a little bit of an age difference, which is great. Uh, still made it really competitive. I think it's mostly just for the exercise and the guys to get out and just socialize too, in a way. So it's an opportunity for players that have participated in hockey, ball hockey, to sort of keep it going against guys their own age level. With a league consisting mostly of players either in their 40s or older, not everyone is in peak physical condition these days. But that's part of the reason to come out and play. And the fact is, is that some of the guys, not all of them, but some of them have maybe slowed down a little bit from their prime when they were in their 20s. And this gives everybody a great opportunity to come out once a week, two hard hours, play competitively, but at the same time realize that it's still fun. And, you know, we want to just go out, enjoy the recreation, the camaraderie, and everything that comes with being part of a team, being part of an older team, if you will, and just having a great time once a week just because they show up to have fun with their friends and get some exercise. That doesn't mean it's not competitive. Most of the guys have played some form of hockey. So yes, it does get quite competitive, but in the end we all realize we have to get up for work the next day. And that's really the key. And so while everybody is competing as hard as they can, we try to put everything into perspective, realizing that there's a lot of respect because we understand we're all in the same boat. You earn everything you do, right? You earn every little space that you do in the hockey also. You've got to skate, you still got to get to the open spaces. Here you got to do the exact same thing. But it just takes a little bit more effort. It sure is a little bit harder. It's no, not much different than indoor soccer or anything else like that. This is the time to take in a game as playoffs are on now. With the finals set to start March 29th at the Rolodome. Because the fact that the league has really upped it a notch this season, things have really got quite competitive and it's a lot of fun. Play some competitive hockey and at the same time get some exercise. I think that's what all we're after, eh? Though on the long run, everybody needs a little bit more exercise. Go out there and hey, socialize, meet people. It's great. For Shaw TV in Prince George, I'm Kevin Neal.